welcome or welcome back to my channel in today's video we are closing out the third week of july and opening up the final week very exciting as usual we're going to start with the expenses i did go a little bit crazy this week with the spending i overspent i took some money out of my miscellaneous aka my buffer envelope but yeah let's go through the expenses and we had 50 in groceries 20 in spending 50 in dine out 32 17 in miscellaneous 65 in uh, um beauty i did a facial and i'm doing my nails later today i already took the money out i do not have my new nails on yet but you'll see them in probably next week's video and then 25 in birthdays i bought some uh, flowers for my friend so in total it was 242 euros and 17 cents for week three let's flip through the actual expenses of this week and we'll go through them we had 485 euros to work with this week and there's really no rollover in any of the envelopes so the amounts stay the same we went 50 in groceries 20 in spending and 50 in dine out we put five in gas 50 in rent five in miscellaneous and 50 in one month ahead so that was in total 230 so 485 minus 230 is 255 so we brought that here to short-term sinking funds 255 and then we had 30 go into beauty 13 into birthdays 10 in uh, clothing and christmas 30 into health and 40 in travel so 13 went into birthdays because we had a weird amount in there and we needed to finalize it so in total we had 133 go into short-term sinking funds so 255 minus 133 is 122 and then we had five going to uh, babies five into car 25 in deposit five into pets 25 in retirement and five into weddings and technology each so in total that was 75 so 122 minus 75 is 47 and all of those 47 we put into our savings challenges so this week no of the uh, amounts really changed and now let's set up uh, next week's budget this is going to be interesting because we have 520 euros to work with this week so that's great as usual we're putting 50 into groceries 20 into spending and 50 in dine out we're putting five into gas, 75 into rent. Uh, utilities is going to get a 20, five is going into miscellaneous and 50 in one month ahead. So in total, that is going to be 275 euros. So 520 minus 275 is 245. So we're bringing that 245 here to short-term sinking funds and we're going to put 30 into beauty 20 into christmas uh, we're not stuffing birthdays anymore because we're fully done for those for this year 10 into clothing 40 into health and 20 into travel so that's 30 plus 20 30 plus 20 plus 10 plus 40 plus 20 is 120 in short-term sinking funds and 245 minus 120 is 125 so we're putting in long-term sinking funds uh, five into babies and car each 25 in deposit we're putting five in pets uh, retirement technology and weddings each so my watch just sent me a notification i've been sitting for too long okay mind your own business that's kind of rude <laughs> and that's 55 going into uh long-term sinking funds so 125 minus 55 is 70 euros and those 70 euros are all going in to the savings challenges perfect so that's your zero euros left to budget which means that each year of our income has a place to go into our budget perfect very excited for this week's i'm go a video i'm going to uh, film this cash stuffing um for you tomorrow and then i'm going to have all the 
regular end of the month videos, the cash condensing, the budget update, uh, the budget setup for next month. Also very excited because I will get my new um, jobs paycheck next month. So we're going to have a little more money to work with. Um, but yeah, that's perfect. Thank you all so much for watching. I'm just going to write this down just so I don't forget. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you have a great weekend great rest of july and i'll see you in the next video bye